Hi everyone, my name is Sharon and I welcome you all to the 11th month of the year. Welcome all to the month of November. So this is what the Lord is saying with the month of November. So God is saying that in this month, he's going to stop the plans of the enemy. Yes, there's something that they are secretly planning. They are taking something from you. They are stealing from you, but it is not going to work out. It is not going to work in the mighty name of Jesus. God is going to appoint you. God is going to anoint you and these things shall happen in this month in the mighty name of Jesus that is why when you go into the 11th chapter which is the book of first kings in the bible the bible talks which is the book of first kings chapter 1 the bible talks about David king David who was now very old and even now when he was sleeping even if they can put clothes on him his body did not become warm and then it talks of his other son called Adonijah who now wanted to appoint himself as king he had gone ahead now called people to come and celebrate him as king and David was not even aware of this and he did not even call the prophet of God to come so he kept it a secret he even kept this a secret from Solomon and Solomon was the one whom David wanted to appoint as king yet this guy Adonijah went ahead and did his own thing and appointed himself. He was trying to cheat the system. He was trying to cheat the blessing, yet God did not allow it. And then now when Nathan mentioned it to Bathsheba, who was Solomon's mom, Solomon went and asked David that, David, you promised me that my child is the one who's going to be king. So what is happening? Why is that other son becoming king? And then David said in the book of First Kings, chapter 1 verse 30 i will surely carry out this very day what i saw to you by the lord the god of israel solomon your son shall be king after me and he will sit on my throne in my place so after this they did all the preparations to make sure that he sits on the throne while the other party was still going ahead the other one thought that he was already king yet here was david now already already making Solomon king. So God is also saying there's no one who's going to take your blessing. God will make sure that he places you in that position. God is going to make sure that you get your blessing. God is going to make sure that you get that marriage. God is going to make sure that you get that employment. God is going to make sure that you get what you deserve. You get what you have promised. You get what he has promised to you, what he has revealed to you in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen.